Hey, hey, party people, it's Lycona DeChichi, and welcome to the Letter from the Producer Live 58 summary. Uh, we're going to go over this really quick uh, because you probably already know, and uh, you probably have already looked at stuff on Reddit and other websites and other YouTubers. Cool with me. We're going to go over this, and uh, I'll give you some information about what I think is going to be really cool during this fight. During this fight. Uh, during this patch once it comes out. Patch 5.3, Reflections in the Crystal. And that's what it's called. Uh, we got some new cool images. We have a new dungeon, which is the new instance dungeon, new main scenario quests. We have new beastman quests, and we have some new chronicles of the new error quests. So pretty much the standard Square Enix-like patch with a lot of good stuff that always comes out. And the thing that I am most excited for is the new Alliance Raid Dungeon, or the Yora Dark Apocalypse Chapter 2. So it's going to be the continuation of that story. So we have some new job adjustments coming up, which we don't know what they're going to be right now, but they'll come up in the second part, because this is the first part of uh, the live letter. The Resistance Weapon Quest updates, which is uh, updating your relic. So we're going to be doing doing some cool thing. I think it's another instance area, so for all you Relic folks, uh, that's there. Crafter and Gatherer updates, pretty standard. More Ishgard restoration. Uh, Sky Steel Tools update. Main Scenario revamp. Uh, I think what the Main Scenario revamp is that they're going to remove a lot of the, uh, the thickness of the Main Scenario, so to make it less grindy, to make it less filling, and one of the most interesting things in the ARR uh, series, which is the Final Fantasy 2.0, is that they're going to they're going to make flying in those areas, which is really cool. So there's going to be some flying in there. That's neat. And then something that is really really awesome and really engaging is the Unreal Trials and Fox Hollows. All the primal battles that exist in Final Fantasy, you're now going to be able to level sync to level 80 and challenge them as sort of the maximum level you can do like right now and play these fights as they were originally intended which i think is really cool because a lot of people who got into shadowbringers and just experienced the shadowbringers story there's only a few ex or primal fights that you know you guys have been doing and uh, have been fighting but the cool thing is is that there's so much more like rich and historic content that happens with final fantasy like all the way back to 2.0 that you know you have Titan and original Shiva and Ifrit and Mugumog, like doing those fights like originally, that's going to be uh, really cool for endgame raiders or even like casual folks to go in and see how those fights were done when we did them back in the day. So that's something that's really cool and I think that gets us to the end of it. So there's a couple of miscellaneous updates, but pretty much all you have to do is, you know, just go to Reddit and browse Reddit to find the latest uh, updates. But I just went here to uh, the Gamerscape because they had like all the slides and stuff. And, um, you know, I was able to do this. I couldn't have done it this morning. I had to work all day, even though I'm at home and I'm still working, you know, got to keep the place uh, connected and alive. Uh, and, uh, and also on that note too, um, you know, for all of you guys out there, uh, be safe you know there's it's a it's a crazy situation that we're all in and uh, i hope that you and your family are safe uh your friends as well uh continue to play some final fantasy get out there and you know have a have a good time and you know hopefully take your mind off a little bit of the the, the craziness that's happening out there so uh, until next time guys keep on adventuring <laughs>